Hey guys, welcome to my discussion on visual analytics using Tableau. So today I'm going to talk about one of the most uh, uh, attractive custom visuals of Tableau and we'll perform a market basket analysis. So in order to take our discussion forward, let's start with creating a market basket analysis with the help of Tableau. So in order to perform a market basket analysis, uh, we'll be working on the sales, store sales data and we are working on the order table for this particular data set. So the first step is that we need to create one more order table and we have to establish a relationship between these two tables. So in order to create one more order table, we need to drag this order table and release it over here. And Tableau will ask you to establish a relationship between these two tables. So relationship is, uh, in order to establish a relationship between two tables, there should be some same criteria between the two tables in terms of column ID or column data type. So let's, let's establish a relationship in terms of order ID for the two order table that we're performing over here. So let's select order ID on the first table and also the order ID from the second table. We can create one more relationship uh, that is product subcategory from the first table, which, which will be a not equal relationship with the product subcategory in the second table. Now that the relationship has been established, let's see what kind of visualization we can do with this particular data set. In my future discussions, I will talk about joining and blending of data in details. But for this particular example, you need to understand that I have created a relationship between two tables which are same in nature with the same data structure. Now, let's go to the worksheet and see what kind of visualization we can perform using this kind of join. So, in order to perform a market basket analysis, we need to drag this order I product subcategory over here in the particular section and we can also drag the product subcategory from the second table into the column section. Now we can see we have got one of one of the custom visuals in Tableau where which will be used for doing a market basket analysis. We can also change the size of this visual by selecting the entire view from here. Now, in order to create a market basket analysis on order ID, we need to create a distinct count for order ID in terms of text and in terms of color. So how can we do create an order ID, a distinct order ID in terms of color and text. For this, we need to drag order ID over the text mark. And you can select this arrow from here. Let's go to the major option and select a distinct count. The same thing again we can do for the color section. We can bring the order ID over the color section. And uh, we can close this particular window. We can again bring this order ID on the color section and you can release it. And click all, add all the members and we can select majors and select a distinct count from here. Now we can also change this particular uh, data of order ID into a shape. So let's select a shape from this particular option and we can select a square option for now and we can see the custom visual is ready in terms of product subcategory using the order ID as a distinct count. Now we can see that both the section of this particular visual chart is having same numbers. You can see 28 over here and the 28 over here. Now we need to remove the particular section of this chart in the left hand side. So in order to remove this particular section, you have to again go back to the data source. And as I remember, I told you that we need to work on the join part in future where you need to change this product subcategory into a less than equal to relation and see what effect it does on the visual part. So the moment we change it to a less than equal to relation, we can see the, the left hand section of this particular visual has been removed. So in order to make this chart more refined, so we can again go back to this data source and we can again change the relationship of the product subcategory. So we can just go over here and you can just select in place of less than equal to, we can select less than and sorry, uh, in place of less than equals to, 
uh, you can select a less than option in order to change the relationship and see what kind of effect this happen this has on the visual level so let's go back to the sheet one and see now we have the appliance and binders in terms of order id so the highest numbers are also highlighted where copy or the computer peripherals and paper are being ordered 103 over here we can also change the access over here with the help of this particular option and we can see the market basket analysis in terms of order id using the product subcategory option of your data set has been ready so this is a typical example of a custom visual in tableau so this kind of visuals we can easily create with the help of performing certain joints or in some cases we can achieve it by writing a small piece of function or with the help of a dual access so tableau gives you a lot of uh, power to create this kind of custom visuals in order to do certain visual analytics which is which is not available in tableau by default in my next section i will also discuss about some more visuals which is actually not available in tableau but we can easily create those visuals with the help of certain function dual access or performing certain join operation on your data set thank you guys for watching this video